Hello everyone, this is G-Shock High Fashion Channel. Today, I have another G-Shock unboxing and review video. Alright, this will be just a standard camouflage box. You guys already seen this one. This is pretty old model. The reference number is GD120CM-5ER. The JDM version will be the GD120CM-5JR. This model is indeed from the camouflage series, released in March of 2014, which is about already 3 years or 4 years up to date. Pretty old, but they are all this still available up to date. You can get this online almost anywhere. So the box is just standard camouflage as the series name suggests and this will be all the papers that I got. I bought this one from Yahoo Japan Auction and this is the non-JDM version so that's why you are seeing all this thick manual book instead of those standard Japanese one. This is the on 34, 27 module and we have this international warranty card as well. You're gonna get this if you bought the non-JDM model and since this model was uh, sold in Japan, they include as well this uh, Japanese manual book that was self printed, I believe. The thing is, features this camouflage design again, and yeah, with some G Shock writing in there, simple thing. This is nothing new at all. I'm just making a re release unboxing video of this same model, which I already made before, I believe. Anyway, I will remove that video of YouTube, but just replace them with this one instead with my commentary on it. And this is the watch. The one I'm holding now is the uh, brown or wetland or green camo version. You can name it whatever you like. But but there are like I believe three only three versions of this. The one from the poster it looks more like brownish yellowish display and all. But if you look at it in person or in other photo, this is all this from G-Shock Japan website actually. It looks more like a greenish. So I believe this model is more greenish than brownish. So I believe this is more like the uh, Asian type of uh, forest, wetland and all that. And for the function wise, they're not, they don't have much. They just date and time at home time, they have a roll time, we have alarm, five of them and timer and stopwatch and we're gonna go back to home time. The main feature of this GD120 model is roll time. Okay, the LED on this space is also very very nice. This one I got over here is in positive display. Overall, the GD120CM model comes in three variations, red with negative, gray with negative, and this brown or green in positive. The positive display has the brightest, clear display and way more easy to see at daytime, I believe, almost anywhere or everywhere or anytime. Both of those negative display actually aren't that black, they are just bluish negative, so when the white LED of this watch turns on, you can still see the time, but I'm not sure about how it gonna turns out or at full daylight when you're outside you know but for the white positive display version is one of the best to tell the time the display is very thick as well I mean so clear very clear and uh, the camouflage design on this I believe it just printed on the top part of the bezel and also the wash band is sort of like uh, combining just I mean very very nice it feels smooth the printing on this it feels smooth and if you are a fan of camouflage or military or tactical style type of watch, this will be the watch for you as well. And since the main feature of this is telling you guys or have a quick access to 4 city world time from home time alone. So if you are a traveler or used to go outside of your city or need have the need to check our city code at the same time or quick quickly. So this will be the watch for you I believe. And again, for fashion timepiece, this is a great piece as well. It looks very simple. Casio Japan uh, matte finish buckle. Very interesting thing to have. Although the back plate states a GD120CM with stainless steel back made in China. I'm not a big fan of this type of back plate, but I gotta say, the way they combine all this, the tin case, the special box overall, I guess that is the way for them to make this watch at a low cost of only about 15,000 yen though still 200 uh, meter water resistant alarm timer super LED with auto light as well I mean this watch is very interesting enough if you are a fan of camouflage especially this specific colorway though and again the price is only 15,000 yen in Japan for JDM version I believe the positive version one is the cheapest out of other three because the other two is in negative and negative looks way cooler than this in my opinion and I believe that is all that I have to share on this uh, camouflage series, G-Shock watch. I hope you guys found this video useful, informative, and entertaining as well. For future reference, 
leave a like if it does and also subscribe to see more contents like this in the future thank you very very much for watching again guys this is g-shock high fashion channel and um